Good morning guys. It is actually 12.25. Um, Ronan had just woke up from a nap, but earlier in today I wasn't vlogging just because I was really tired and I just didn't feel like it. And some people were sleeping so I didn't want to be loud. So yes, we had a relaxing morning. I officially got out of bed at like 9 or something like that, but I was up earlier with him because he was hungry, right? And he's been a pretty good boy today actually. Yesterday was kind of, you know, he's being a little bit naughty. He was like well fed, he didn't want to play, he didn't want to sleep, he just wanted to complain, so that was kind of stressful. But today seems like he's doing better, he's interested in playing and being quiet and observant. Yeah. Very calm today. Oh. I am currently waiting on my mom to pick us up because we're going to go to the yard sale with her since she's selling some of her mom's stuff from her house, like, you know, furniture and cooking wear and stuff like that. Oh, do you want me to put you down? So I actually ended up doing a bunch of stuff after I filmed that first clip because he was being a big old booger. <gasps> you smiling at me now. Will you be in a big booger? Yeah. <laughs> he says I smile all the time because I know I'm naughty. Yeah. You're holding on to my toes. Yeah. <laughs> he has an imprint on him from breastfeeding because he like rests on my jeans. And it makes an imprint. <gasps> you gotta put some clothes on. He literally, co it's AC, there's AC in here. And last night he took a bath and I was like, oh, he's probably cold. So I changed him and put clothes on him, screamed. He like hates putting clothes on even when he's cold. You're a funny boy. <laughs> yeah. I love your double chin. Yeah. And he loves putting his feet in the air. I always look over at him and his legs are straight up in the air. He just makes me laugh. You're so precious. This morning, I mean, obviously I didn't vlog a lot, so I'm sorry for that, but um, I did take a clip, actually, of him doing tummy time, so I guess I'll insert that right now. <laughs> He's a funny boy. What are you talking about? <laughs> I almost did it. And as you can see, he did a good job. He rolled over. It was an accident, per usual, but I think eventually he'll learn, like, you know, what made him do that, and he'll put it together. So that's fine. Um, we did a lot of cuddling this morning, too, and that was nice because I just I just love to, like, hold his hands and just stroke his head. And does anyone else, if you're a mom, do you, like, smell their hair? Because I smell his hair all the freaking time. He has such a comforting smell to me. I can't even describe it, but... You smell like you, and I love you. Hmm? If you guys are ever wondering why he's wearing the same clothes in these vlogs recently, because I tried to pack kind of light on this trip, and since we do laundry like every day anyways, they're clean, do not worry. If you're a mom, I'm sure I don't even need to say that. <laughs> oh, no. no, not the hair. Don't do that. It means no worries. <laughs> Days. It's a problem free <laughs> philosophy. I call a matata. You're a big old faker, you know that? We spoiled. But I love you. <laughs> At the yard sale, Ronan's hanging out. Uh. Oh, yeah? What else? Yes, I agree. Really? <laughs> yeah. Are you telling Mama a story? <gasps> yeah. Yeah. Are you telling Mama a story? He says with spit too. It's a better story. Why do you like that, huh? 
<laughs> Ronan had a good time because all my aunts and my mom were passing him back and forth and playing with him, making him laugh, so that's always good. I feel like it's nice for other people to play with him and socialize him because he's with me so much. You only play with mama at home usually. It's not as fun. But yeah, he took a really good nap after that. It was like, I mean, it was not a long nap. It was probably like 20 or 30 minutes, but he slept hard. Like his mouth was hanging open. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now we're just Snapchatting with people and I'm probably going to watch some TV. So I'm not going to vlog that, but Devin gets home in like an hour or two. So once she's home, I'll probably vlog a little bit more. What are you doing? Oh my I said I wasn't going to vlog till Devin got home, but I lied. I'm watching KK and BBJ. I actually don't watch them that much anymore. Oh! But they're doing their gender reveal stuff, so I'm watching them prepare for their party, and then I'm going to watch their party and stuff. I'm going to... I think their you now is where you can find out what gender the baby was, so... Oh. Actually, it's not even houses. What are you doing? Ronan was having a small meltdown because uh, I wouldn't help him stand up, but I can't help him stand up as I'm holding the camera. So he's doing some tummy time on the towel next to me right now. I mean, he's talking away. Yeah. Yes. It's a lot of drool. Careful now. This kid. He's trying to go off the edge. <laughs> Roll on to mama. Hi. <laughs> Are you trying to escape? So I had to stop so I could feed him because he was being ridiculous. Um, But now I'm caught up on KK and BBJ. Let's zoom in on him a little bit. A little bit more. A little bit more. He does this when he's bored now. He just holds his toes. Um. But I can't find their you now. I'm trying to, I'm trying to find their you now so I can watch their gender reveal party. And the last one that I can find on the site is from like 45 hours ago, which is not from today. Um, so I don't know what to do. Just trying to find out. And I don't want to like, you know, I want to be surprised. I don't want to read through comments and find out what the gender is. So I'm on a little mission. And he's just like pretty much milk drunk. He's just laying there, touching his toes. <coughs> This is what he's been doing the entire time that I've been trying to figure out what the sex of the baby is. So that's kind of progress. He doesn't usually self-entertain that well, but he's just covered in spit and I'm going to have to wipe him down before I go find myself a snack. I hope they have some salsa or something because I'm starving and uh, I don't think Devin gets home for another hour. But I did find a little clip of KK and Baby J. They were like throwing the uh, darts at the balloons and it popped and I'm not going to reveal what it is on here because some of you might not have seen it yet. but. I guessed accurately. I'm excited for them. It's super exciting. Um, congrats to the couple. Their children are cute, so whether it was going to be a boy or whether it's going to be a girl, it's going to be a super cute, super loved baby. I want her paler than the moon, with eyes that shine like stars. Oh yeah? You like Mulan? I couldn't care less what she wear or what she looks like. It only depends on what she cooks like beef, pork, chicken. Mmm. Ronan has the hiccups. I am watching Friends. I'm like in love with Joey, I have to say. If I was like a person on the show Friends, I would try to date Joey, but I've been eating watermelon just straight out of this thing. Uh, or no one else wants to eat it. I'm not gonna lie, I put sugar on it, but it tastes so good. I'm sorry you have hiccups, it doesn't sound fun. Ronan is sleeping. Devin is making this quinoa veggie burgers currently. So I think you changed a few things, right? Yeah, I don't make it into a burger because it doesn't really form patties very well. Right. So I just do it stuffed into like pita pockets with the veggies. Yeah, and you use Rice Krispies instead of 
Okay, so breadcrumbs. Two pieces of breadcrumbs. And this is like a very, very long convoluted recipe that I have like pulled <laughs> down into like a not normal very many person. Steps, like food. normal person food, yeah. yeah. So it's, I'm not following it exactly what I'm supposed to get. I'm excited to try it. Gonna be good. Like it. I think we're gonna watch What Women Want because it's on Netflix, but Rona is a. Uh, napping so I don't know if he'll stay asleep but he tends to he always freaking wakes up like right as I sit down to eat so that's why I'm gonna bed is I sit down pick it up and then ah, crying Ronan is currently doing a back bend sort of thing and trying to shove his hand in his mouth but I'm vlogging because Devin went to go run and get some ice cream for us yes we love ice cream yes we love dessert um, we've been watching What Women Want over there, and actually what happened was exactly what I thought would happen. I like went to put the food in my mouth, and he woke up screaming, and then I felt really bad because he was like, like he couldn't be consoled after that, you know, when he woke up, he was like scream crying. So I did some leg stuff, because he hadn't pooped all day, and I put him on like his tummy on my knee and like pat his back, and eventually he let out a fart and a lot of poop. It leaked. He was wearing like a red onesie. It leaked all the way through, everywhere, got on my hands, so he feels much better now. I would try and get him to give you a smile, but he's like very preoccupied with his hands as of late, so he really doesn't smile all that much, except for underneath them. Um, but I think I might wrap up the vlog now. Darn Blarg did ask a question of the day. They said, when Ronan gets six months old, would you ever let him do the spa thing? where they put a floaty around his neck and let him float in the water. And I'm not exactly sure what you're talking about, I guess. I didn't know that they put a floaty around their neck. I guess that doesn't seem comfortable to me. Um, but I will be obviously looking to like put him in swim lessons at some point, and I want him to definitely explore the water. I try to put him, you know, in the bath and let him splash around and like get comfortable with water as much as possible and like the pool and stuff. Um, and I do really want him to learn swimming before I did because I personally, I was like the youngest of four and the youngest of my entire family. He's sucking on his thumb if you're wondering what those noises are. He's just kind of groaning about it. Um, but I didn't learn how to swim until I was like, I don't know, in like fifth or sixth grade because, yeah, swim lessons like suddenly at the Y that we went to like ended and I only had learned how to do like you know, like the weird slippery seal into the water and stuff, like I legit didn't learn any actual swimming lessons yet at the lessons, so yeah. I learned, I think in fifth or sixth grade, I learned how to swim by myself. I just kind of like learned naturally somehow how to swim on my back, so I could only swim backwards at first. I would like look behind me at where I wanted to go and then swim backwards and then be there. And I like could like doggy, like I could like tread water but I couldn't swim forward and I couldn't swim on my side and then I learned how to swim on my side and then last I learned how to swim like doggy paddle or whatever you call it like when you swim forward so it took a while and it was embarrassing um, but yeah I want him to learn a lot sooner than that so I will definitely be getting him in the water the AC has kicked on so I'm gonna stop talking because it's always like really loud yeah. <sighs> Hi guys, it is actually Sunday morning. Um, I wanted to end the vlog because I forgot last night. I was playing with this little one, having some fun. Um, but if you liked the vlog, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, subscribe. And we will see you next time. Bye!